This week in math, we're going to take a look at multiplying by one and two digits. You'll notice the numbers on the bottom are different colors because they represent different place values, and you'll see how they work as we start to multiply. So let's take a look at question A. First thing we're going to do, because we're dealing with the ones column, is we're going to change the color to red. One times four is four, and then we take a look and we go four times two is 8. So the answer to the question 21 times 4 is 84. Now if we take a look over at question B, we can take a look that we're now multiplying by a two-digit number at the bottom. So the first thing we're going to do is we're still going to do the same thing and we're going to go 3 times 6 which is 18. We're going to put the 8 on the bottom and the 1 at the top. Then we're going to go 3 times 3 is 9. We can't forget that 1 up there so we're going to add it. It equals 10. We no longer need that one, so we're going to cross it off. Next, we're going to take a look at the 2. So we're going to change the color of the pen to 2 because we're now in the tens column, and that 2 doesn't actually equal 2. It represents 20. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put a 0 down here like this. We're going to go 2 times 6 is 12. We're going to put the 2 underneath, and we're going to put the 1 above it. Next, we're going to go 2 times 3 is 6, plus 1 is 7. Almost done next thing we're going to do is we're going to add the two numbers together. And we're going to go 8 times 0, or sorry, 8 plus 0 is 8, 0 plus 2 is 2, and 1 plus 7 is 8. So our answer to the question 36 times 23 is 828.